April's Soto Sulu eclipse promises to be a scientific bonanza thanks to new spacecraft and telescopes and cosmic chance. Portland Community College physics professor Toby Dietrich plans to perform a modern version of editing experiment during the eclipse. During this eclipse on April 8th, uh, I'm going to be performing the modern Eddington experiment, which is an experiment that measures the tiny deflection of light, bending of light, as it passes the sun on its way in, into our camera. The original experiment was first done during the 1919 Toto Solo eclipse by a team of scientists off the coast of Africa that tested Albert Einstein's theory of relativity. The moon moves around the Earth, and the Earth, as it moves around the sun, at some point, the moon becomes exactly between the sun and the earth, and you can see a shadow right there. That shadow moves from west to east across the American continent. Scientists got a taste of what's to come during the 2017 total solar eclipse that stretched from Oregon to South Carolina. The the point now of a continuing to perform this experiment in, on April 8th is because we can do it infinitely better. We can get way, way more data. We can get data close to the surface of the sun where the bending is the maximum. April's eclipse will begin in the Pacific and make landfall at the Mazatlan, Mexico, heading up through Texas and 14 other U.S. states.